So in the previous video, as you remembered, we have worked and completed the login form. Now uh, it's time to work on the register. If you come here to the register page, I mean whenever the user, I mean the seller click on this picker, I mean on this pick image, we will send the seller to the gallery in order to pick any image for their cafe, okay, registration alongside with the other information and of course then we will work on get my current location for the sellers so let's just do that first of all on the register dot file we have uh, here we have to create a function future void and we can give it name as get image underscore get image it is the function name async and in order to pick image from the gallery we can using the image picker instance which is picker we can simply say underscore picker dot pick image and we have to define the source for it and the source is image picker image source image source dot that is from camera or from gallery so we will go with the gallery that's it now this will basically allow the seller to pick an image from the gallery now once the seller pick an image from the gallery we have to assign it to any variable I mean in order to later of course we will upload it to the cloud storage and save it to the cloud fire store so in order to assign it to any variable we can simply use our variable which is image x file which we created I mean this one okay so you can say image x file equals to this since this is a synchronous function so we have to wait okay wait and that is once the image is picked from the gallery we will assign it to the image x file and also after this we have to update the state okay so we can simply say set state and we can say image x file okay just to make sure that we get the image from the gallery inside our image x file okay instance so I, in order to display it here so that's why we do this set state here so anyways now the next thing is to just call this get image function in here where we have over this button okay so inside the inkwell we can simply say on tap and then we can call that function which is by the name underscore get image okay that's it now let's just test the app click here send us to the gallery now from the gallery you can pick your cafe or restaurant image or your cafe restaurant logo so let's choose any image from here okay here you can see it so it is working fine okay that is really nice Let's click again choose any other here you can see it so yeah it is working fine now in the next video we will work on getting the seller current location that is the cafe restaurant location so I'll see you guys in the next video bye for now